Three siblings are now South African citizens. Their mother had left South Africa for Namibia, where the children were born. She died on her return to SA before she could acquire citizenship for them. It's been a difficult four years for the Vox sisters. They moved to another country. Their mother died. And when they tried to get citizenship in the country of their grandmother, they were sent from pillar to post. Meryl Diabok nearly didn't write her matric exams. But after SABC News highlighted the sister's plight, the Education Department and Home Affairs intervened. I'm actually very glad to be declared a South African citizen. So far, so good. Everything went well. All through, things were difficult, but it went well. Now armed with documents, the sisters are planning their future. My vision is for next year to go to college and make my dream come through and I'm glad for that. Um, when I'm next year when I'm matric, I don't have to suffer with those things here. The grandmother is in the process of applying to adopt the children. I feel very, very proud and very happy because God answered me. I thank the Almighty God. She's only waiting for the, for the letter, then we go to the uh, magistrate office and then we can fix up the story. The sisters say they are proudly South African citizens and are confident that they will have a bright future in their adopted country. Ulrich Hendricks, SBC News, Rietfontein in the Northern Cape. Zimbabwe's